Super Lightweight Aluminum Rollator. Your Super Light Rollator arrives in a semi-assembled state. Arrange the parts on a hard flat surface to make the process easier. Notice that the parts are marked with the letters R and L, which stand for left and right side. The kit consists of the right front wheel, the right rear wheel which has brakes and the handle attached to it with the brake wire, set of bolts for the wheels and the handles, mainframe assembly with the storage pouch attached, the back support, the rear left wheel with the brake wire and the handle, and left front wheel. Begin by unfolding the main frame as seen on the video. The front of the frame is where the logo on the pouch is. Place the frame on its side. We are going to start with the left side. Grab the left front wheel assembly. Make sure both the wheel stem and the tube of the mainframe are marked with the letter L. Push down the spring-loaded locking pin and insert the stem into the front tube. The first hole the pin emerges from will be used for the security bolt. Slide the stem further. The second hole corresponds to the tallest user, the third is for the medium height user, and the fourth will give you the lowest ground clearance. Choose the hole according to your needs. Use the bolt with the triangular head to secure the wheel. Screw the bolt into the nut welded to the underside of the tube. Do not over tighten. The front wheel is now secured. Grab the rear wheel assembly. Make sure the brake is facing out. Insert the stem into the rear tube. Just like with the front wheel, move past the first hole and choose the same hole you chose on the front wheel. Once the locking pin is in place, secure the wheel with the bolt with the triangular head. Screw the bolt all the way into the nut welded to the underside of the tube. Do not over tighten. The rear wheel is now secured. Grab the handle and insert it into the corresponding tube. Twist the handle if necessary to untangle the brake wire. The wire should remain on the outside. The logo on the handle should be facing out. Align one of the pre-drilled holes with the hole in the tube. You can adjust the height of the handle by choosing a different hole later when the rollator is fully assembled. The bolt assembly that is used for securing the handle consists of three parts, the bolt itself, the washer, and the pentagonal knob. Feed the bolt through both the hole on the handle and the tube from the inside of the frame. Place the washer in place, curved side up. It should fit snugly onto the curve of the tube surface. Screw the knob all the way in. Do not over tighten. The handle is now secured. Repeat the entire procedure for the other side of the rollator. Grab the back support and insert the ends into the extensions on the front of the rollator. Push slightly until you hear the spring-loaded locking pins click into place. And last but not least, use the plastic rings on the sides of the rollator to secure the brake wires. Just snap the wire into the ring as seen on the video.
Your super light aluminum rollator is now fully assembled and ready to take you on a long, satisfying walk around the neighborhood. If you feel tired, just lock the brakes to prevent the rollator from moving. Grab a bottle of water from the roomy storage pouch and have a seat. Easy to operate, sturdy and maneuverable, the super light rollator from Healthline USA will help you go anywhere you want and enjoy the fully active lifestyle you deserve.